And a group of Jackson firefighters gathering at City Hall today demanding a pay raise, an increase they say they haven't seen in years now. Now, three on your sides, Chris Fields joins us live with reaction from today's City Council meeting. Chris? That's right, Howard. Jackson firefighters did not hold back at today's city council meeting. They say they want their department to be up to standard with all the other departments here in the metro area in regard to pay. They say they want their pay to reflect the hard work they provide to keep people in the, here in the, the capital city safe. It was standing room only at today's city council meeting as dozens of Jackson firefighters made their voices heard. Union President Rashawn Thomas also appeared before the city council in October 20, 2021 and again the following year. A temporary salary increase was approved but never materialized. Now union members are asking the city to adjust salaries according to their ranks. They say it could be done by using funds from the American Rescue Act funds the city received two years ago. We want to see a pay increase, a significant pay increase for every JFD firefighter on October 1 when a new budget is in session, is in season. A new, we want to see a total of new pay raise. We want to be able to see the raise and not see the insurance rate climb up and pay go down. We're looking for that on October the 1st and we're not taking no for answer. Yeah, I thought they did a great job today as far as uh, them speaking up about what, what kind of raise they needed and, and uh, they, they, they have to come up with a solution on how they're going to get the raise. I mean, they're, the city does not have the funding to, to just give a big raise like this. So. Okay. Now, Thomas says they are giving the city two months to meet their demands. Now, City Council President Aaron Banks says this matter will be taken up at this year's 2023-2024 fiscal budget season. Reporting at City Hall, Chris Fields, three on your side.